Today we will learn about building a KPI and a Power BI. That said, if these are the type of videos you'd like to watch, then hit that like and subscribe buttons and the bell icon to get notified. Just for a quick info, if you want to upskill yourself, master data analytics, and land your dream job or grow in your career, then you must explore Simply Learn's cohort of various data analytics programs. Simply Learn offers postgraduate programs from Purdue University in collaboration with IBM. Through this program, you will gain knowledge and work ready experience in skills like prescriptive and predictive analytics, regression, classification, and over a dozen others. That's not all, you also get the opportunity to work with multiple projects and learn from industry experts in top tier product companies and academics from top universities. After completing these courses, thousands of learners have transitioned into a data analytics role as a fresher or moved onto a higher paying job profile. If you are passionate about making your career in this field, then make sure to check out the link in the pinned comment and description box below to find a data analytics program that fits your experience and areas of interest. Now without further delay, let's get started. Now let's quickly open the Power BI window. So we are on the Power BI window right now. So here we can see we have already loaded the data. We have the filters, visualizations, etc. And we have the cans over here. Right. So in the visuals section, if you closely observe, you have the KPI over here. Right. So you can either select and drag it onto the canvas or you can just simply double click and create a KPI. But before that, what exactly is a KPI, right? It's the key performance indicator, right? It's a full form of KPI. So what exactly is key performance indicator? Let's say we have the sales dashboard over here, sales data set over here, right? Now we have region-wise sales, we have country-wise sales, we have region-wise profits, we have region-wise uh, discounts, we have quantity, right? So it's like a visual, it's like a number, clear, literal, readable number right on top of your dashboard, right? So if you just want to have a quick glance of how many number of sales you made, how's the profit happening, how's the sale happening, how's the discount that you're getting, right? And how many number of quantity of certain product has been sold in a segment, right? So those are the key performance numbers which will be available right on top of your dashboard so that's exactly what you call as a kpi now how do you create a kpi so one way is you can just hold the kpi and drag it onto the canvas or so this is one way of creating the kpi let's remove this now another simplistic way of creating a kpi is just double click anywhere on the dashboard or the canvas and you will have this so, so just write what kind of kpi you want to create so i want to create kpi for sales just create that and you have your kpi there now another one kpi discount just click on that you have the kpi for discount double click once again kpi for profits you have the kpi for profits now kpi for quantity there you go that's how you create kpis in power bi should you need to arrange the kpi sizes or color or background you can also do that by just simply playing around the sections over here right so the background or the the outline section over here you can just play with it you can increase the size decrease the size add a background you have a setting over here you can do anything that you want right so that's how you create kpis in power bi and with that we have come to an end of the session on build a kpi visual in power bi should you have any queries regarding any of the topics covered in this session or if you require any of the resources like ppt dataset and the dashboard that we created in this session please do let us know in the comment section below and our team of experts will be happy to help you as soon as possible until next time thank you for watching and stay tuned for more description to know more Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.